Good morning, everyone. I'm Jan Carabeo with your morning digital news brief for Sunday, June 27th. Gun violence continues to ravage the city of Philadelphia. A man is shot and killed in the city's Port Richmond neighborhood. That shooting happened just before 1 o'clock this morning at Memphis and East Cambria Streets. Police arrived and found a man shot in the face, stomach, and arm. Medics pronounced him dead at the scene. No word on the motive for this gunfire and no arrests. A man is fighting for his life after he was gunned down in Philadelphia's Oxford Circle section. The shooting happened early this morning at Leonard and Fanshawe Streets. Police say a 54 year old man was shot multiple times there and then jumped into his car and drove himself to Frankfurt and Bustleton Avenues. That's where police picked him up and took him to the hospital. He is now in extremely critical condition. And a 10 year old boy is dead after police say that child accidentally shot and killed himself in North Philadelphia. The shooting happened around 6 o'clock last night in a home on North Broad Street and West Pacific Avenue. Police say that boy and his eight year old sister were home alone. Police say the sister ran to a neighbor for help. Officials say that gun should have been in a lockbox. The children's father may be facing charges. Now to the eyewitness weather forecast with meteorologist Larissa Abreu. Hi, Larissa. Hey there, Jan. We do have a heat advisory that's going to be issued later today. It'll stick around until Wednesday at 8 p.m. So we do have a long haul as far as this heat across the city, our surrounding areas where heat index values will be ranging from 95 degrees expected today to 103 as they reach their peak by Wednesday afternoon. Today's high will climb to 91, a hot one, and of course with that humidity, as I just mentioned, heat index values will be peaking in the mid 90s. Winds will be out of the southwest between 10 and 15 miles an hour. And as the day wears on, these numbers will continue to gradually increase. Take a look at the next six days. Your afternoon heat index will peak by Wednesday. We're tracking those heat index values to be close to 103. So dangerous heat unfolding for us both Tuesday and Wednesday. Going to be hot at least through Thursday before we finally catch a much need to break Jan by Friday with scattered storms and those temperatures in the mid 80s. We're going to need that break. So will our ACs. Yeah. Thank you, Larissa. Appreciate it. And remember, you can always get the latest news and weather headlines right here on CBSPhilly.com. I'm Jan Carabeo. Have a great day.